kubwa kati moja nilikuja naye hapa our brother Kandie Andukete Kandie from the center of the barracks doctor of barracks come now you remember kuna bendu nakumbuka yeah in marriage as our brother eh uh, wait his wife
We are the ones who are nice to Yeah, so we expect that most of us will attend those meetings. And that's a problem. Yeah. 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 And then we have uh, meetings with uh, our pastors that uh, we've been told that we've Vietnam, Canada, or Duma, Brother John, about the Brother Kyoko, Brother Kyoko, Abraham, Yet Abraham, and Brother Waswa, Yet Waswa. Yeah, they had asked that we have meetings with them. Last year, I think it was last week on Thursday. Yeah, we can buy the people from I was with them. 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 We had planned with them to meet me to start on 28. Uh, but uh, we had started to get yeah, to start on 26. But we, uh, we, have, we have put them, we have brought them forward. So that we have them on 19, 20, and 21st. We have put them on 19, 20, and 21st. We have put them on 19, Yeah, 
Never ask for offerings from them. No. Please, the child supported him. Yeah, uh, can you say it moved up for the case of Duma? Those, those meetings wherever he went. It is his church that supported the meetings. That is the mission of the world. Let us be grateful for them. Yeah, bless the name of the Lord. We are trusting that God will help us. Give us enough resources. A yeah, man. Yana mzuri. Uh, a great good time. Talk about very good things. And uh, very encouraged. the name of the Lord. Amen. Yes. for my wife. Salam to And uh, brother Kuni also sent me greetings. Brother Misaka. Yes. Misaka. Amen. Amen. Uh, uh, I will be Brother Misaka's church on Friday, this coming Friday. I told him I cannot go. But he really pleaded. Uh, so I found it very hard to tell my old friend that uh, I cannot go. Uh, but I mean, books on the problem, but yeah, so he really greeted and that's the time so that I go there. So I'll be going on Friday. I'm going to go to Sofiri Islam. On Friday. So I have to go Sunday. I have to go And he was asking, what are you doing now? How many of you are going to go? How many of you are going to go? Just come along with some people. Yeah, so I'm trusting some of you. Nah, it's my papa by the end. That you like to cross over and know Uganda is. Yeah, you can you can accompany me. Yes, uh, Blessed be the name of the Lord. Yeah. We love the Lord Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Ah, that's all. That's because it's already uh, is this program. Shall we stand up and just sing one song? Yeah, we'll just manage to go to the scripture. Let's read the scripture. I also want to bring you greetings from Joy. Depend on the person I'm talking about. Joy, you know I used to call her Joy Chilchil. When I'm in touch with you, Chil. Yeah. When I talk about Pesa. Amen. I spoke to her. Uh, she told me she is in comment. And yeah, we have comment. I talked to her pastor. And the pastor was very happy. But I just was sad. Amen. Amen. I want us to sing one song here. Let's sing one. Let's read the scriptures. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. 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 Let us sing song number 25. Uh, three days in the Can you pass up your book? Oh, to Jesus, I surrender. Oh, to
Lakikiwa na chakula nguo tuvike na vitu hivyo. But they that will be rich fall into temptation and as now. Ni hao watakaokuwa na mali huanguka katika majaribu na tanzi. And unto many foolish and hateful lusts. Na tamaa nyingi zisizo na maana which ground men in destruction and perdition. Senye kuduru si watozazo wanadamu katika upotofu na uharibifu. For the love of money is the root of all evil. Maana shida moja na na mabaya ya kila namna ni kupenda fedha eh which why some covetous after ambao wengine hali wakitamani hiyo they are error from the faith wamefarakana na imani and pierce themselves through with many sorrows na kujichoma kwa maumivu mengi vitu vizuri vya imani but thou o man of god bali wewe mtu wa Mungu free these things Uyakipie mambo hayo and follow after righteousness ukafuate haki and godliness na utaua and faith na imani in love upendo patience na subira and meekness na upole respect and godliness i love the lord no eti mungu thank you so much we are shukuru sana for your grace upon us lord neema yako yetu bwana we appreciate lord Lord, shukuru bwana wetu scriptures that we have read maandika ambayo tumesoma we pray that the holy spirit naomba kwamba roho takatifu will help us lord that to say dear bwana my father i pray trust in the lord that we will know what so bwana mimi kwa kutapanga neno lako and that god let it please you kwamba kwamba itakupendeze lord god you will take out my understanding as a man bwana mungu taondoa kuelewa kwangu kama mwanadamu the holy spirit took over and brought the people to the children those who are to listen from the mother they can only benefit if they hear from you father speak to them you see lord as it is pleases you let your will be done in the earth as it is in heaven let your will be done on earth as it is in heaven let your will be done on earth as it is in heaven there is not worthy of thee in the name of jesus christ Kijana Yesu Kristo tunaomba. Eh, ina spesi. Naweza kiti. Mwanaweza kuja sana. Amen. Now as the uh, you all know, na vile mnavyojua nyote, eh we are talking about giving account before God. Na simuzie kusipeana hesabu mbele ya Mungu tunakutoa hesabu. Amen. Amen. We are giving account before God. Toa hesabu mbele ya Mungu. And uh, I want to uh, uh, I want Rachel to give us this quote here. Uh, Rachel Pati Ku. So we are talking about giving accounts. Hai tunasungusia kutoa hesabu. Eh this month we last time we talked about giving account of our words. Mwisho wetu tulisungusia kutoa hesabu ya maneno yetu. And our thoughts. Na mawazo yetu. Bless us in the name of the Lord. Inabarikiwe sana. Now uh, it's, it's quite long now. Ni kuza mbali ni mrefu kama jo sina now. Ndio kwa I've not I've not been I've not been preaching here. Yeah, I'm going to be here happen. Then I bless you in the name of the Lord. You know I'm going to be here. Yeah, so uh I want us to start on giving account for money. Utoe hesabu kuhusiana na pesa ama fedha. Bwana wetu asipesa. Amen. Utoe hesabu kuhusiana na pesa. Giving about the money set ama rasimali zetu. Amina. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Are we together? Now as I many times say, kama vile daima nilikwenda kusema, before you get into a relationship with money, kabla uingie katika uhusiano na pesa, make sure uhakikishe that your relationship with God, kwamba uhusiano wako na Mungu wako is very good. Yaani nzuri. Are we together? Pamoja. Are you paying me attention? Yeah, mm-hmm. We are saying, nasema, don't get into loving money. Usiingie katika kupenda fedha if your relationship with God 
Kama usiano wako na Mungu wako is bad. Ni mbaya. Because we have read from the scriptures. kutoka katika maandiko. Baba pesa is a snare. Ni mtego. You know that there's a whole difference between being tempted and being and Kuna tofauti kubwa kwamba kujaribiwa na kuwekwa katika mtego. Mtego. Yeah. Kuna tofauti kubwa sana kati ya being tempted being being tempted and being and snare. Let's be the name of God. Yeah, I mean, Are we together? Kwa pamoja? Please be with me. Tafadhali mkwe na mimi. Bwana atapesa. Amen. See? Now no. so, I've seen many people. Nimeona watu wengi. Even ministers like so, me. Duma kama mimi. Yeah, when it comes to money around money, na pokuja kwa swala la pesa, we become very weak. Tunakuwa wadhaifu sana. We eat, we can easily compromise. Tunaweza patana sana because there's a spirit behind money. Sababu kuna roho nyuma ya pesa. That is not good. Ambayo sio nzuri. Amina. Amina. You believe what I'm saying? Amina. 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 Blessed be the name of the Lord. Ina banda ya pesa. There's a spirit around money. Kuna roho nyuma ya pesa that is horrible. Ambayo ni ofu sana. Now I want to read something from the prophet. Now I'm reading from Church Ages. The Sunnian Church Ages. Now this now this is nothing against rich people. Because God can save a rich man. Some of God's children are rich. Baadhi ya watoto wa Mungu ni matajiri. Amen. 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 Now, you brothers, hey, you are sisters, and our dad. Let us, let us fellowship. Amen. Go for more Amen. Are we together? Let us fellowship. Amen. And the way we fellowship, Nigeria, we fellowship is that you know. Well, you know when you talk I talk like that. Some of God's children are rich. Baadhi ya watoto wa Mungu wao ni matajiri. We can go back to the Bible. Na tunaweza rudi katika Biblia. We can see Solomon was rich. Tunaweza kuona Solomon alikuwa tajiri. Wakapo wanajua kwa Solomon lunch peke yake. How many knows that in Solomon's place one lunch alone? Wao wana chinja ngombe 600. They were spending around 600. Hiyo ni ngombe. Those are cows. They are not they are not cows. Kuku. They are not chickens. Wanaita mpya sana. Amen. But money can be such a snare. Lakini ndugu dada, pesa inaweza kuwa mtego. Please get that. Tafadhali upate hiyo. Are we together? Tafadhali. But money can be a such a snare. Lakini pesa inaweza kuwa mtego hivi. Not only those who have it, ziko wale tu wale ambao wana fedha, those also don't have it. Na hata kwa wale ambao hawana hata kidogo. Now to those who have it, it becomes a snare in the use of that money. And by the grace of God, I'm going by, by the help of the Holy Spirit to prove to you how we together. Okay. Uh, what that statement means. Yeah. Those who have money, their problem is there is snare wamewekwa katika mtego from grace na wanakuka kutoka kwa neema and they lose god na wanampoteza mungu in the way they use money katika the money wa fedha ambazo wako nazo in spending it yani katika kutumia hizo fedha yeah amen blessed be the name of the lord that's how even if you have money that's how they are in snare even if you are not katika mtego in the use of that money katika utumizi wa hizo fedha because brother God has a very specific instruction. Mungu ana maagizo ambayo iko imara. Imara. Yeah, on how we should use our money. Jesus tunapaswa kutumia pesa zetu as believers. Kama waaminiwa. As Christians. Kama Wakristo. God has given us explicit instructions. Kama ya kutosha. Yeah. Yeah, you know the Bible which are so plain, very plain. Yeah, ni wasi kwa so that you cannot say you didn't know. Ili wewe usiseme sikujua. Are we together? Tuko pamoja. And those who don't have money. Na wana ambao hawana pesa. And snares. Wao pia wanaweka katika mtego. Because of the last. Kwa sababu ya tamaa. Are we together? Amina. See that's how they are snares. Na hivyo ndio wanaweka katika mtego. Listen. 
Kisa. Way back there in the first age, kwanza, James cried out to those who are putting stock in wealth of people. Yohana alilia kwa wale ambao wanaweka Yakobo. Alilia kwa wale ambao wanaweka rasmali, wanaweka matumaini yao katika rasmali. Yeah. No, waliweka matumaini yao exactly. Kwa watu ambao wana. Katika watu ambao walikuwa matajiri, people who are rich. Are we together? Kwa pamoja. Did you know? Yeah, we want to. That that spirit has never died. Kwa hiyo 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 hiyo. James spoke of it. The company men of Jesus in the first age. Sakia kisasi ya kwanza. And he warned the believers. Na kaonya waaminio. Not to put their stock. Wasiweke matumaini. If men and women who are wealthy. Katika wanadamu na watu ambao wana fedha. Are we together? Kwa pamoja you come to a church na pinde katika kanisa you will find utapata people a brothers and sisters kwa ndugu na wadada who are not well and those yani ambao hawana hawajaheshimiwa kwa namani they are no place to have they money get to a place kuna finger mahali is like they want to worship brethren who have money kama kaku wakuta kwa enemy wa pesa wenye wana fedha yeah Say that this grievance si ni kwa baba wa milio in their home hata wakiwa makosa this poor fellows hawa masikini jamaa don't want to say anything hawataki kusema chochote kwa sababu ya this brother unaona huyu ndugu this is the huyu dada she is doing wrong anafanya makosa but because she is money just money so ana fedha yeah now you find it to her because you are depending on her for yeah, you need to go to recognition because of your name take care you see at the side here recently he assisted you you see at the police office paying for you are we together amen. respect of persons eh hey, shima sa wanadamu amen how not the faith of our lord jesus christ with respect of persons usiwe na imani ya yesu kristo kwa heshima sa wanadamu ah i didn't know it here but as you way up the poor there were trying to back up the rich in order maskini hapo walikuwa wanajaribu kupapasa matajiri katika utaratibu in order to get help ili kwamba wafaidike rather than trusting in god kuliko kutumaini na mungu amen you might not even believe us amen don't do it usifanye hivyo say it anasema yakobo don't do it usifanye hivyo this is right kisa tu money is in everything kia pesa si kila kitu Can you say me to that? Yeah. You believe us be under a condition. You are not praying to Master Ben Amina for you. Are we together? Pamoja. Money is in everything. Pesa sio kila kitu. Money is in the answer. Pesa sio jawab. No. Hapana. And today, na leo, money is not the answer. Pesa sio jawab. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Kama ndio sana. That is the prophet. Na wewe nabi. Glory be to God. Kufa Mungu. Now, sasa I am calling believers. Ninawaambia waaminiwe. And I want you to believe na ningependa kuamini that every single coin in your pocket, kwamba kila pesa ambayo uko nayo mfuko ni mwana. Every child of God, kama wewe ni mtoto wa Mungu. Every money, kila pesa that comes to you, ambayo inakuja kutoka kwa Mungu. Are we together? Pamoja is is from God. Inatoka kwa Mungu. God is the source. Mungu ndiye chanzo of the believers money. Ndio yeye chanzo cha pesa cha waaminiwa. The one can do what they want. Mwenyewe unasafanya kile wanataka. Uweza kupata fedha. But I want to tell you. Lakini nataka kukuambia that the believer kwa mama waaminiwa depends solely upon God. Anamtegemea kikamilifu Mungu. And because God is the source of your money. Kwa sababu Mungu ndiye rasmi chanzo cha rasmi yako. Nisikize. God will want you to give account Bwana anataka upeane hesabu. How you spend every single cent? Jinsi unavyotumia kila pesa ambayo unayo. Do you believe that? Na nini hivyo? Eh you are saying uko nyuma mna ni bado. You are man you getting me behind them to go. Kwa bwana. God will require you. Bwana atakuitisha. Eh brother, ama atadai. I'm, I'm trusting that God will give me the answers to this something to say here. Na mimi Mungu atanipa neema sana kwa Allah. Nataka kusema kitu tunapendelea. Something very very crucial. Kitu ya muhimu sana. Ni kwa leo nitumie ya saidi kufika pale. Money is the answer. Ah, pesa sio jawabu. And today, na leo hii it is not is is not the answer. Pesa sio jawabu. We have more wealth. Tuko na fedha nyingi ama utajiri mwingi. Utajiri mwingi. Yeah. That we have never had. Kuliko ile tuliwahi kuwa nayo. And yet, lakini less is being accomplished spiritually. Ni majacho ambayo yanapatikana katika 
hali ya kiroho yani wakati tuko na pesa nyingi sana na lot of money kiroho kuna vitu vitatu ambavyo vina vinafanya sinafanyika spiritually we are accomplishing less things zaidi mambo machache sana why kwa nini because the believer someone in you has to realize hajatambua where to put that money mahali pa kuwekeza hizo fedha zake how to use that money na pia kuweza kutumia hiyo pesa bless the name of the lord yeah, yeah. 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 and i want to tell you na nikipenda kuambia iba if I'm wrong, may God forgive me. But I want to tell you that the way you spend your money and your resources is almost a hundred percent proof the petition where you are sealed from. Yeah. And God, I'll prove that. And Blessed be the name of the Lord. Now in every age katika kila kizazi when God raises up his message wakati Mungu alimwomba mtu wake wa neno lake in that age katika kizazi the people of that age watu wa hiyo kizazi the believer waminio is sealed anatiwa muhuri by the spirit na roho of the message ya ujumbe of that age yani anatiwa muhuri na roho ya ujumbe ile kizazi yake i don't know blessed be the name of yeah, the lord i want to repeat nikipenda kurudia hiyo msemo every age katika kila kizazi and its message hii ilikuwa na ujumbe wa ujumbe wa and the message na ujumbe that god raises ama ujumbe aliyoa in an age katika kizazi that message wo ujumbe the the spirit of god Mungu, that raises that message ujumbe, that is, spirit your is the one dio that seals the people the believer, in that age they are sealed by that message muri, but by believing that message ujumbe, you believe that na hiyo the spirit of god that has raised the message in any age katika kila kizazi cha leo that is the spirit hiyo ndio roho that seals the people ambaye natia muri watu they are sealed wanaotolewa by believing the message of their day kwa kuamini ujumbe wa wakati wao so they are sealed kwa hivyo wanafanya the spirit of god na roho mungu in their day katika siku yao now listen that's pizza in that same age the people who would not receive the message what about what of the attitude of the people how the zama ya watu was the message husiana with the age you go back to our is what helps the devil to steal the people diani tazama wao inasaidia shetani kuachia muhuri kwa watu kama ina mengine the seeing in every age oh kutiwa muhuri katika kila kizazi always was concurrent yani ilikuwa inaenda sambamba god is seeing mungu anaweka muhuri siri shetani anachia muhuri wake you believe that na mimi hiyo but god cannot see the people and he has raised the message mungu hawezi kia muhuri wangu kabla ile ujumbe are we together kwa pamoja now sasa in this age katika kila kizazi Kama unataka kujua what kind of a spirit you have aina gani ya roho uko nayo look at the way angalia vile your attitude mtazama mambo your feelings hisia zako your perception yani kuona kwako mambo to the message kulingana na hiyo kwa kuwa ujumbe wakati one namba moja two namba two look at how angalia vile allocate your resources vile wewe unapeana hapo na weka rasilimali zako kwa hiyo neno ya yeah, to that message of the word what you do kile unafanya with your resources na rasilimali zako when they supporting the word wakati kuna kuunga mkono neno supporting the word kwae kuweza kuunga mkono kazi not yani unaunga mkono ama hapana hiyo kazi what God has raised kuunga mkono kile Mungu ameinua are we together kama yeah. yeah. your resources kama na simani zako is not supporting that hayuni mkono hiyo you are sealed from somewhere else wewe unatiwa muri kutoka mahali pale your perception kama mtazamo wako if your attitude kama mtazamo wako towards the message 
message of your day you believe that that's how you are sealed the Holy Ghost comes upon you as a seal because of your faith in the revealed work of your day that if you refuse or in other words if you are negative well, to what you do know, this is me as we skis our passage. If your mind, come on, I'll say, if your thoughts, if your feelings are negative, we can do it to the message of your day. Now, to the work that you are going, then you are sealed as well, not your way by the enemy. Now, do it. You believe that? Now, to prove to show that, to show that, when you say you're saying that means we can have people in the church to know as a point of. See that as we are seated. But they are already sitting. Oh, the Lord says, the sitting is going on. It is going to have two days then. There is something going on. But brother, why, are you, why, why is the seed in the forehead? Your perception. Your attitude. Your thoughts. Your thoughts. That is not 
not an outsider. Yes, you share that you are supporting an apostle of God. It's an ordinary. It's a statute of God. So, if you are paying your tithe, your offerings, don't count on that. Blessed be the name of the Lord. What God wants to know now, what do you do with the money that is yours now? That God has put you, you have given out what belongs to you. Now, what do you do with this? How do you, what do you support? Now. What do you support? I'm going to read to you now. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Brother Branham says, and the believers, they take their money to go for picnics. Yeah. And they don't support our work of God. See? You see how people are seen. Maybe it's like that. Right? In the church. And son. They claim to be believers. When I die for a video. But they have a man. Like you want to allow Why? When he, because of what they support. What about your kill and out of the With what they have. Kill one night. Your authority. Mamulata. Your power. Buza. That which is within your power. Yeah, my katika was what? How are you using it? They were like to be a man. Where are you putting it? How is it serving God? How is it serving children of God? Amen. Now it is there. Ah, it is there. Ah, it is there. Yeah, it to us. But yeah, he. Today, Leo, he, uh, they are trying to take the place of God's title. They are trying to adopt something. They are trying to make it different. Okay. No, just give us your words. Okay. Now listen, preference. We are talking about money. Giving account. It looks like it's a simple matter. But I want to tell you as and with humility, that brother and sister, money is as now. Better than Do you believe that? I mean, evil. Hey. Brother, Amen. if you are not saved, come on, watch money. Where are you? Don't play with money. Are we together? Amen. Don't run for money. If you know that your heart is not right with God, because brother, because brother, because sister, hey, give us that first, uh, that first, uh, first one. See, where we read. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Can you, I, I just want to be very uh, be with me. This is, is a, and having put a very very big with that. Who are the person and who? Now, let us go to verse 9. But they that be rich fall into temptation and are Are we together? Amen. Now, Sasa, I want also to prove to you like this that poor people who don't have money are also very rich. They are rich. Because their minds, what is a rich is your mind. Yeah, what fills your heart? Come on, my dear, I want to have money. I want to have money. You don't have money, but you are full of lust. You are a rich person with money. Because of lust, that's what the Bible says. They fall into temptation. And unto many foolish and hurtful. And Amen. That is the meaning of it. Yeah. That's what the man will do to you. See? Yeah. It will hurt you. It will See, you get into debts. See, you have a lot of money. You misuse it. 
Unaitumia vibaya. You, you use it very carelessly. Unaitumia bila kujali. Yeah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Ndio mambo yake sana. We from men ambayo ina ina submission wa submission wa watu in destruction na katika uharibifu and the perdition na katika kusimu kusimu kuapeleka kusimu jana you will go to hell tena jana because of that I'm telling you the truth na pia ukweli don't play around with money usicheze na swala la pesa for the love of money kwa sababu ya kukiri the truth of God in you yani pesa ni uzizi wa maovu yote it is not the money sio pesa it is the love for it ni kule kupenda pesa is that right amina while some committed baadhi ambao wengi walitamani ya walikuwa na tamaa ya hiyo pesa they committed money they erred from the faith waliondoka kwa imani waliondoka imani they erred from the faith who you know kama you dada is well on this is ana pesa she has money lakini kwa sababu ya jinsi anavyoitumia because the way he used to she used to be imani she get away from the faith who you know kama dada is well on this is ana pesa she doesn't have money lakini kwa sababu ya tamaa because of the last of imani fanya ondoke imani makes that person to get away from the faith Yeah. Oh. Let's say be the name of the Lord. Ina maana hiyo sana. Na let me need a statement to you here. Hebu tusome msema hapa. Bwana wetu abarikiwe sana. I read that statement. Nisome msema. When I was preaching this today on 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 Monday the other time. Nilikuwa nikihubiri kuhusu pesa wakati ule mwingine. Bless be the name of the Lord. Ina maana hiyo sana. Amen. Are we together? Amen. Pamoja. I want to read something to you here. May the Lord be blessed. Amen. Malika malika pata to mane. Now listen. That's giza. Eh uh, The Bible says we are stewards. Bila na sema sisi ni walinzi. Is that true? Yeah, when you pray. Amen. I'm asking is that true? Yeah, when you pray. We are stewards. Sisi ni walinzi. This is right. Is you are not only a steward when you see blinds it true of God's money kwa pesa za Mungu you are a steward when you blinds it of every resource wa kila rasilimali that God has put in your life ambayo Mungu ameweka katika maisha yako amina amina you are a steward when you blinds it of every resource ya kila rasilimali kila rasilimali every resource Iwe ni kuku, iwe ni chicken, iwe ni punda, sadangi, iwe ni shamba, land, iwe ni maingi, iwe ni chochote, anything. Amina. Amen. Now listen. Let me say. I'm reading this statement to you. Na somea usema kwako. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Jina baraka liko sana. I wish you really supported me. Na kamani kama mkeniuka mkono na mmsikia. I really was God that you support me. Niliuliza sana na niuka mkono na mimi nitafanya hivyo. Listen to this thing. Kisa kwa msema. Faithful stewardship. Waamini kwa lisi waamini kama uami faithful stewardship. Yaani uwakili, uwakili mwaminifu. Yeah. Ama uaminifu, uaminifu katika uwakili wako as faithful stewardship. Yeah, you are steward. Wewe ni wakili. Ama mlinzi. Mlinzi. Oh. Yeah, neno ni wataelewa. Yeah. Wewe ni mlinzi ama mtunzaji. You are a steward. Ama manager. Hmm. Wewe ni mlinzi. Yeah. yeah. Is that right? Amen. Wa kila rasilimali ya Mungu of every resources of God. Mnaipata? Amen. You getting me? Sasa, they inaitajika. It is needed of you kama wakili as a steward inaitajika kwako it is needed of you let's say be the name of the lord amen you will not accept it ni mtsono msiki it is required of you inaitajika kwako ama unaitajika that you manage kwamba ulinde the resources rasilimali in your possession katika miliki yako in the manner katika njia that reflects ambayo inaangazia the heart of the owner yani inaangazia moyo 
mwenye hizo rasilimali mwenye rasilimali yani ona of the resources wewe kama wakili you are sustiwa unahitajika you are needed please get me right unipate vyema you get what i'm saying na pale tunasema you are required wewe unahitajika if you are a faithful steward kama wewe ni wakala mwaminifu i'm not talking about an faithful steward this is muziwa na bosi wa mimi i'm talking about faithful stewards na sisi kusu de it is required of you inahitajika kutoka kwa kama unahitajika this resources kwa hizo rasilimali the god has given you ambazo bwana amekubidi to manage kulinda na kutunza manage them usitunze according kulingana to the hearts kulingana na moyo of the owner mwenye alipatia mnanipata sasa haiwe kimila inaona mwanzo neno lingine if the faithful steward kama wewe ni wakala maminifu go to the owner umwende mwenye rasilimali find out what is in his heart na wewe kuuliza nini ambayo iko kwa moyo wake oh ndugu na dada oh brother and sisters you know najua I feel very miserable. Yani I'm telling you, kwa mtu wa mashaka sana na wewe. Oh, not helping me. Baba hamnisaidie hata kidogo. Wewe ndio baba pesa. Ni huyu mkono. Amen. Au tena, tuko pamoja. Go to God. Mwende Mungu. He is the source of your money. Yeye ndiye chanzo cha pesa sana. He is the source of your resources. Yeye ndiye chanzo cha rasilimali kwa nani? Before you start spending the resources, kabla uanze kutumia hiyo rasilimali, go to God. Mwende Mungu. Find out na uweze kutambua what is in his heart. Ni nini iliyo katika moyo wake? In his heart, katika moyo wake. How does he want this to be spent? Anataka namna gani ila simani hilo la. Find out. Tambua. God. Bwana, how do you want me to spend this? Unatakaje nitumie hilo simani? Give me this. Umenipatia hii. I come to you. Nakuja kwako. You are the source. Wewe ni chanzo. You are the owner. Wewe ndiye mwenye. Just tell me. Niambie basi. Your whole heart. Moyo wako wote. Tell me what's in your heart. Nieleze kilicho moyo wako. What do you want me to do? Unataka mimi nifanye nini? With this you have given me. Na hii ambayo umenikabidhi kwa moyo wako. Ndugu, you get it now. Napata hiyo. If you don't do that, usikofanye hivyo. Bali you have a problem with. Wewe unashida na Mungu. See, and you'll find it out that sooner or later. Na baadaye utatambua hivyo. You like to tell me the truth. Na mlikwe nikwambie ukweli. Yeah. Amen. Go to God. Mwende Mungu is the source. Give me chance. Listen. Kisa. His resource, yet was in my sake. He starts with your life. Inaanza na maisha yako. Yeah. Amen. Hallelujah. Go to God. Mwende Mungu find out. Tambua muulize. Bwana, how do you want me to live? Unataka mimi niishi na gani? How do you want me to do this? Unataka nifanye nini mambo na mna gani? Tambua ile kwa Mungu. Bwana, how do you want me to go about this issue? Unataka mimi niende hili hapo na mna gani? This time that you have given me. Haya maisha ambayo umenipatia. How do you want me to spend it? Unataka niishie na mna gani? Where do you want me to spend it? Unataka ni nitumie na mna gani? This brother. Is a God God help us. Bwana tusaidie. Every morning brother. Kila asubuhi do you for you go out. Sasa unaondoka waende. Go to God. Mwende Mungu. God. Mwende Bwana. I am going out. Mimi naondoka naende pia. Where you want me to go? Wewe unataka niende wapi? Where do you want me to go? Ni wapi unataka uniongoze niende? Where do you want me to go? Bwana unataka niende wapi? Unataka niende? Oh, wewe wapi unataka niende Bwana? Where do you want me to go? Where do you want me to go? This is the day of me today. Unataka niatumie kwa kitu gani? On which thing do you want me to use it for? Find out from the heart of the owner. Tambua kwa kwa moyo mwenye alikupatia hii maisha. Mwenye alikupatia hiyo maisha. He has given you his life. Yes, no maisha yako. Where do I place this? 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 Where
What do I need to do with this? I tell you. Because God speaks of today. Sisters, 
Yes. This time, 6 p.m. we are waking up. 6 in the morning. As we are going to be. Amen. There you have gone. Baba, my amuka. The father of waking up. Amen. He has gone. What all the men who have been gone, children have been left in the hands of the devil. The whole day, sick of Zima. What all the what all the children are together. They have been left in the hands of the devil. See? Glory to God. When they come by the Father home, is too busy. Baba, when I the me. mother is too busy. Mama nae, me. The father is too tired. Baba may talk. The mother is too tired. Mama may talk. There's nothing they do. I put a kid on a fine. That's the God's resources. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Do not know anybody to a Are we together? Can we come from Moja? See, they go to help us. Why not stay here? Now listen. That's Pisa. So, where you go? We are talking about money. The Simusia Kusu Pesa. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Do not know anybody to a son. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Do not know anybody to a son. See? Give me the monology. But here, this for the reader, I think. That would give me this my paper. This for the reader, the monology. Pay paragraph 34. Paper can tell you how you do it. Yeah, 34. Amina, Amina, okay, 
not minding God at all. The Bible says, the Bible says, mind God. Remember God, mind yeah. God. Root you here. Come back to us. Go back to the word. Is that right? Amen. We are all together. Brother, it helped us. It has helped me. I speak from experience. And I have told you. And my My son was this. Brother, you know that. Now when you are teachers here, no. Why do you want to do it? Go see us. Yeah. Una pata mshara ya moja mia sita. Na mshara mia sita. Sama nini? Na hiyo mia sita kama nini ifanye shukuri zote. And this na uzalisho wa toto. That's all things and you take the children to school. Right. When I got the message. Ni papa ndio mtu mbele. Ni msaidia. I'll do what you do. Ni kwa kila kwa sababu I've got the fun. Nikaenda kule dai. I passed it without even beating or batting an eye. Jambo la kwanza kama la kusumbua. Bila kufumbua na kufumbua macho. Nikitoa tu kwa shimo hapo. Nikaenda na baasha. I don't want to the better old mambo ya Mungu. Yeah, it's like the Diana with the things of God. I tell you, I don't know. It's not my mind. Why don't you pick up na piga kufikiria prosperity ya mwenyewe? Why are you better why is like the Lord is Mungu. The man as man is God. Na ni Mungu. And is God. Yeah, he's the one who has given me. So like the more. So when I get to my day, it was God. I don't know what she said. It's more of me. And I'm going to I put in the same of God. It is my wife who used to pay our tithes. If you want me to call you, you will come around. I do call you more than you. We don't have the money, brother. And I can stand here and tell you. And there is no one that can be here. How God has come to me. We have come to say, "Be the greatest God ever." Yeah, I have come to say, "Be the greatest God ever." Yeah, I have come to say, "Be the greatest God ever." Yeah, I have come to say, "Be the greatest God ever." Yeah, I have come to say, "Be the greatest God ever." Yeah, I have come to say, "Be the greatest God ever." Yeah, I have come to say, Blessed be the name of the Lord. I'm taken on safari trips. And the things like that. See, then he says, I know it is done for the kingdom of God. In a cure, your first time to find an amen that you found on you. Amen. That's what I say, man. The time will come, the apana. Then I say, it's a thing. No. My money. Where's I am? What is left of me? Let me tell you something, brother. It has happened to me in the whole series with all you need. I even planned on how we are supposed to pay offering with my wife and the children. We planned on how to pay my offering and tithes. I was not even aware of me. Now, but I don't know what to do. I used to stay with eight or about four, five sisters and about how many brothers. I had around 12 people in my house. Yeah. And I take them to church and bring them back. Now, I'm going to say goodbye. But it was here that it was on me. When they are sick, I think they are. Yeah, my wife will get the doctor to come as a man. And you have to walk through before they come down. Oh, my Yumba. Yes, to be a young teacher. See? I used to plan. If you want to fight in a bad way, Mama. Mama, very funny. You pay this. First Sunday. Very funny. Second Sunday. Second Sunday. Third Sunday. Third Sunday. Both of them became a routine. And it was to cover. And we did it, we did it to join. Pulitanya na kurafra. Brother, hakuna siku tulikosa. There is no way we run. Hakama kikosa, and we run. God came down. I want to tell you, brother. Every time my wife wanted to go to the employment, I would feel off on a mafia. On a mafia, we are going to pay you 6,000. We will pay you 6,000 or 2,000. Brother, in the name of the Lord Jesus, I said, yes. I get promoted. Even I And they pay me a vision of two thousand. And I'm telling you a testimony. Now I'll be able to put that out your way. Yeah. And we never have. Blessed be 
the name of God. You know what I mean, I can stand God the kingdom of God. That is right. You deserve. And then when I answer, that is the day of judgment. It will be the best that I know how to do. It will be the best that I know how to do. You took a 
alamo pale for me uli 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 nipa dakika ya upendo uli nipa i didn't want this to happen sikutaka hii ifanyike but thank you lakini asante just the same sawa i need it now na hitaki sasa on my california trip yani kwa ajili ya safari yangu ya kwenda california i will I'll put it the gospel. Hiyo nitaiweka katika kasi ya injili hizo. The little offerings that you give me so that I can talk about some of the patia. Inanipata kweli. I get it friends. Sikii nani anielezee atusaidie kueleza hiyo. Naona huko ndio ndio big experience this was. Amina, Amina. He's not saying the little offering you bring the church. Si kwa maana anasema sataka ndogo kunaleta kanisa. No. Anasema you bring to me. Mnanipatia mimi unalipa mimi they were giving to the prophet walikuwa wanapeana kwa nabii so that was his money yeah he got pesa yake yeah are we together kwa yeah. pamoja it was his money kwa pesa yake so it is the power kwa hiyo alikuwa na uwezo to know how to spend ujua bila kaitumia he had the authority alikuwa na mamlaka to put that independent he had the authority to support what he wanted alikuwa na uwezo ya kutumia kuunga mkono kila alitaka and i'm going to read to you somewhere na nikaenda nikaenda nikisomea mali fulani he tried to support the red cross alijaribu kuunga mkono red cross what the red cross yeah and he really discovered ah na wakatwenda katambua that they were using that money wrong na walikuwa natumia hiyo pesa na mali first visa i went to puerto rico nilienda kule puerto rico puerto rico and jamaica kwa Jamaica a few weeks ago nikaja mwezi mpita where they registered 40000 converts in 9 nights wakati wale andikisha ah uh, one wao wao kwa baibi kwa mikutano ya simo hisa what did it ni nini nifanye hiyo amina ani what did it ni nini nifanye hiyo so kwa hiyo so kwa hiyo
I had plenty of money then. You just passed the collection plate two nights. And it would pay all the expenses. And then, you had a t-shirt too. So you have a lot of money left. Amen. I want to tell you, brethren. Even Since we preachers, we have a lot of problems. When it comes to spending good money, some of us have been bought very cheaply. Because people who right are money, good preachers have been bought by money. Very easily. Yeah. They are compromising the gospel. Yeah. The they gospel. cannot preach straight. How is it Because people in that church so what the are rich. They give a lot of money. The preachers. Millions. Now a million wakona million. He cannot. Our mama condemn with fly. Yeah. He cannot rebuke sin. Yeah. You cannot bring the message straight. Where should we be? You may be in a car. Because people will go away. Because we what they what we are not correct. Our end. Move outside here. In order to help us. And then now then now if they had a red a red cross right now can't we go now? Then what for Red Cross? What we do now? Campaign, come here, polio. Campaign, like polio. I'm a doctor. We go and make sure my freaks in the bed, 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 in bed, 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 bed. So we have campaigns. Then we will, we will save the water. Yes, sir. We have water. So we have now. Can you see? Are we together? Amen. Or something in kind of a dry. Can you tell me how you got it? All your dry or something? We would go right ahead and help them people. Make an offering in our church. Give it to the people. And then sometimes we we'll just turn it over. To get to. To get it over. Uh, to the city. Money is too much. And they go to a place, friends. Yeah. It was become almost like you wouldn't get out of town till they would be saying, We are a bunch of horrors. You give money. This happened. And you have given money. Is that right? Yeah. 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 Brother, do, do you know? Yeah, man, you are. Come on, get to us as a person, you are not going to say to you. If you know sometimes the money you take and help your own people. And the things they talk about, the money you have. Yeah. Yeah. You know, a demonic charge. Yeah. In the worship us. Yeah. Now, you have to wash your life. And you have given hands. I don't know whether you get what the prophet is saying. They will give a lot of money. And when they go away, they are back. They are being abused. And that's what we are doing, brethren. I'm not saying we can help our people. The Bible says this. If we are believers, the Bible says this. Do good unto all men. Sister, 
I want you to organize for meetings. Mimi nataka upande mikutano. And give me the budget. Na hiyo gharama yote ni yangu. Where are those people? Hawa watu wako wapi? Wako hapo aina hiyo. Where do we have such kind of people? See? Familia to be what peke yao. Family to be what alone. If we can challenge, if we can challenge Eh nani anakuja kutubiria? Who is coming to preach to us? Tunaita brother Mansa kutoka Mombasa. Yes, bring brother Mansa from Mombasa. Transport ya kuja na panda ni mimi. So, eh, all the transport coming up. Kwa mali ya talala ni mimi. Who that way will sleep it's my expense. Amia because of the budget ya kanisa. Yeah, they go to the budget. Wana fanya budget. They do the budget. Shilingi 50,000. Alafu transport ya mubi na nini na nini? Na huyu ni mimi. Elsa si. Around 30,000. Elsa mario. Angalia Brother, those blessings follow follow your children. This of our lives are not our own. Are we together? Uh, Blessed be the name of the Lord. Yeah. We are not doing those things. Have you found your mom? See, and we are not going to tell you. Na hatuenda kuambia hapi watu kipatia labda mani tufanye mikuta atuambie mtu and we eh if you give us a we are not telling anyone here hatutaki watu wajue ni biwatu ile ukipinda safu hiyo ndio ndio wale mtu asifai we don't want that hatutaki hiyo we want the glory to go to god we want to bless the children and we are going to talk yeah yeah Now, but when you can't, and he expand your job. Yeah. Let's get to be what I made for Panarabia. You just hear from you, just in Kwenye Nairobi. Now, today, from today, you have given your notice in the evening. Yeah. 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 
That is what we need. Na yeye mnahitaji mapenzi 50,000. Hebu msii. Yeah. Watu wanachaga kwa 50,000. Yeah, people just yeah, they do for the so they have to gas. They need to do the work. Yeah. But so that is a great favor. Hiyo ni kibali kikubwa sana. Now, people we see that the brother problemed favor because of the city. Na hii alikuwa na kibali kwa sababu alikuwa ni mtume. If God can give us a favor a people like us. Kama Mungu anaweza kutupatia kibali watu kama sisi. Kama kama sisi. Like the people like we. About at five, we are not even one. Na the hell of kupatia nafasi ya kuhubiria. And I can also give you a chance to pray to them. And you want to take it for granted? No, that we to go to Kimzamza. No. Hapana. Bless be the name of God. Yeah, like I want to get a blessing. Yeah. See? So, kwa hivyo, it is very very important. Ni muhimu sana to be careful with money. Kuwa mwangalifu na pesa. See? Very very important. Ni muhimu sana. Let me read this one and finish. Tuko pamoja pesa. Amen. So you are offering your money. Pesa yako na dakika zako. Bless you in the name of the Lord. Oh, you know that like you sana. Eh, uh, I think it is uh, questions about being God being misunderstood. Mungu atakusa kueleweka. Amen. 61 07:23 Now before we can read that quote let us read Haggai chapter 1 Some Haggai chapter 1 moja Yeah Bwana yeah. 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 Haggai chapter 1 moja
He brought five sacks of meat that had not been. Which means it's about two bucks in My share in the Kumbaya around two bucks. Then he left with Brother Miana's place and then he went away. Five letters. And he caught only two and a half bucks. Is this time for you? Eh? Is it time for you? Okay, sorry. You've sold much. I'm bringing little. You eat. You have not enough. You drink. You are not filled with drink. You clothe. You are not filled with drink. 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 Put into a bag with hopes. And a bag of shara e putia that come fuko will your toboka toboka. Nani a toboka man, 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 Child there. Kibiza, yeah. yeah. Taking the baby to the real hospital is very sick. Very sick. Call your son. Attack people. People don't know. 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 People don't Kidogo tu hivi. Tell her you did. Naambia mama yako ni mgonjwa. Your mother is sick. Kidogo tu hivi. Bibi lola baadaye. Kasi yako ameingia jioni huko mtarajia. Your cousin comes in your with expect. Yaani mungu anahakikisha mashime mejaa kila mahali. All men's your hopes are everywhere. Yeah. And your mother is happy as quickly. Yeah. Alright son. Yeah. Alright na sasa iko ya madeni. You start now as I come text. Yeah. Day in day out. Siku inaingia siku ya yeah. siku na mchana ni madeni peke yake cycles of days why kwa nini it is god ni mungu he has said consider your ways amesema sitafakari dia ni siku stani mnataka tena mazenu na kula vizuri sitatajua ya bana inaenda kwa well doing well and the house of god is in trouble i was asking brother mrunga brother uh, brother Isha, I was asking Brother Mungu yesterday, yeah, how my message the person that has been happy? How many have, 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 have we collected money for the seeds? How much have we collected for the seeds? Yeah. As I'm going to be later, the person that has been happy. Only three seeds. Three seeds. He did that to turn to Tangasi. From the time he announced. And people are eating. They are drinking. They are going to suffers. They are buying dresses. They are making hair. They are buying shoes. And what they are doing. Children are going to school. Not only the children. When I come to school, amen. When I part, are you getting me? Come on, we will be able to get this. Blessed be the name of the Lord. I need just help you today. Yeah. We are here to master one or two in Kenya. Yeah, just help me. The king of the land is in Kenya. We go move on in Kenya. Amen. When I come to school, amen. See the house of God. You may have me. There are people here. You know what will happen? At our feet, brought it. You know what? They don't even know how. Our feet, brought it. You don't know how we build. At our feet, you want to build. They don't even know how this will be. It's like they are not part of this. They are not part of this church. How are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing? They don't care. What are you talking about, sir? Amen. See, God is warning us. Move on to order. Watch your ways. Consider 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 your I'm going to trust this kind of brother man. I'm trust this man. Okay, sir, sir. Then you tell him now. Me, Mr. Kusemi, I don't want you to say anything. I'm going to leave you with this 5,000. Yeah. Just, but for some because here, you could do a man. This is your act to know who have the needs in the church. Yeah. One letter, okay, sir. Amen. 
Watch and find your kazi. Then you do the work. And you obtain it with all your heart. Don't be fanya na moyo wako wote. Sio kwenda ukalumika nilipea. Nilipea na. Sio juice hata nilipea. Nilifinyia mwanje wa kazi. Wanacho kwa sababu. Amen. That's not the order. Hiyo sio utaratibu. Let's admit the name of God. Jana mwanje wa kazi. Don't trust yourself. Ndugu ningependa kuuliza kitu. If a man like Cornelius, mtu kama Cornelius, a gentile mataifa mataifa only know anything about Bible. God hajua kitu kuhusu Mungu but you know brother kwa sababu tu kwa sababu tu ya kule kujitolea kwake because of his sacrifice many people what when gentiles wa mataifa get to Christ wakuja kwa Kristo where is your cora yani all those tricks that speak it is the only place in the bible ni mahali pekee katika bible that people receive the holy ghost and they were baptized Mwanamke maskini si analimia watu si blouse mzuri shamba 
anaenda kulima kwa watu hewa itumwa ni kwa kuoshia watu nguo na sapata pesa yake she gets a little money na nabii anasema alikuwa muaminifu katika fukwe ya matoleo yake she was faithful in her giving and tithes yeah tithe and offering the fukwe kubwa na sadaka alikuwa muaminifu kama wakala muaminifu yeah Then one day when we were protect the like Kanisa. They want to when they want to protect the Jehovah. What has place? Let us give her our prayers. Only what she had. Al bayana yo tabari kwa na. Yeah, when they put I mean, aka aka ni bayana. Brother Nana wants it. Yeah. Brother Nana wants to come and hear. We can say my father. I love this sister. Never need to enjoy that. Ana bidia alugumu sana. And she always would want the best. I don't give this money. बुरा <laughs> akasema mtoto mimi Mungu aliniambia is God told me ni Mungu aliniambia mimi out there that's why i say even when i say in stewardship katika uwakala bwana leta barikiwe sana it is required inahitajika that we kwamba sisi use the resources to to me is the primary that God has put in our possession kwamba wewe katika umili kwake to the heart of the owner ingana na moyo mwenye alipeana alipeana kaje and she went with that money na yenda na hiyo pesa rather she put it the pocket and the heaven remember that and people itakumbuka hiyo when brother brother visited her wakati mtu mama alimtembelea brother look akamtebelea na wote wengine na she was a sister na alikuwa yeye sijui na mna gani i don't know how i can tell you alikuwa anakaribisha wanduku kwake she was very coming brothers in her home no na mimi nasema wanakunywa chai turungi they were taking some strong in her home wao kama mambo ya Mungu talking about the things wao kwenye kawaida city even they don't go in the city in the kitchen the kitchen yeah that's why they will see brother they have this team gather na kuna na timu yake brother nana love going to start at this place so mali peta kuikwenda kwa nyumba ya mama hati kwa kind of spirit because all the other people are there na Mungu wa mbinguni looking down akiangalia chini come down and say alishuka na kusema tell this lady ambia huyu mwana mwana ana chiwa anataka ni chiwa millions of dollars anataka milioni ya pesa right now sasa hii go tomorrow sio kesho hasisa islam dada yake ni karibu na anaweza kuponya sasa hii no tomorrow sio kesho ask her muli let us ask her mwambie ulize kujoti ask her
to church. Si and you don't pay your tithes. Si you pay your tithes. You pay your money for my parents. When you are in school, you are slave. What happened to you? She is here. I thought of Mungu and said, And she wanted to go to help her. God told her, No, you are a thief. Mungu All this money you are being given as you are surrendering who bring a formula. Who never paid you. Was it like that, sister? It was like that. God told her, I cannot do that. Where is your idea? She came and told her. To cover your sound there. Then we made mathematics. Mathematics. Four years he was in school. How was he was not paying for a trade. A trade. Yeah. Then we did mathematics. He went and he did the work. He went and the work. He did the
kutumia vizuri. You know the moment you appropriate it right. Wakati unaitumia vizuri na kuipangia vizuri. Ukipangia tu vizuri. Yeah. God gives you grace. Mungu anakupatia neema. Haitamsumbua. You never do. Uta katika mtendo. You never get it. Like you ukifanya kosa. But if you do something wrong, unaitumia vibaya. You use it in a wrong way. Yeah. You have a problem with God. Wewe una shida na Mungu. Because they are passing. Oh, we love the Lord Jesus. Amen. Amen. We stand up for us to see the song. Oh, I thank God for that. Amen. There is this song.
Yeah. 